Hello everyone! This is Neon Fox Let's Plays and what are you seeing right now? What is this? Okay, so for those who uh, haven't been paying attention at all to the end of uh, Sly 4 or didn't watch that, essentially, I have left the camera Let's Playing behind and I finally gave in and got a capture card. Oh my god, I can't believe I got this to work. So let me just say this right now because I'm pretty sure the one big question is why I never got a capture card before. And there's a few good reasons on why I never did. And there's really only two reasons. Number one, the first reason is money. I really never had the money to actually get it. Most of my money i am kind of been using for college and I really just can't afford to you know spend it on stuff like that and the the camera was a lot cheaper and you know i thought getting this this whole dazzle setup would have been a lot more expensive and it turns out i was right so the the whole video camera capturing setup while i do it uh didn't actually cost me as much as i thought it only cost me about um a good a hundred dollars that was like under a hundred dollars and that was with shipping and everything so it wasn't that much um, I'm not counting Final Cut Pro and into that. That's that's completely unrelated. But with uh, my new setup, I had to get a Dazzle. I had to go out and I had to go get extension cords. Well, I actually have to go return those because those aren't even needed. I had to go out and get splitters. I had to go out and get another RCA cable. I had to go get another line-in cable. I had to get a bunch of this formatting stuff. Uh, it was a big pain. And literally, I took most of yesterday to actually do it. And that was a day of hell to finally get to work. So, um... Pretty much what this video is, is just to show that I now have a capture card, um, as well as to talk about camera let's plays, and also to talk about let's play number 21. <coughs> Sorry if I'm sick, I got sick over the New Year's, and, um, you know, I just, eh. uh, but yeah, this is also just kind of a test video to make sure that this all works and I can do this. Um, really quickly, what my setup is right now is that I have a, a Dazzle. I know Dazzle's kind of sucky, um, but it, it worked. I got a refurbished one for only about like $45, but even then, most of this still cost me about over $100, so yeah. Um, oh, I never explained the second reason why uh, I never uh, uh, got a Dazzle before any capturing device like that, and the way I did it just kind of worked. What the reason is, is because usually Dazzle stuff like that, that's usually geared for more of Mac users, I mean uh, PC users, and not Mac users. And for those who don't know, I have a, I'm a Mac user, and God, that was dumb! Get out of here, Tennessee kid! Where are, where do we go, where do I go? This way. Ah. Um, so that's kind of why, and believe me, I've actually tried with capturing devices before. I have tried at least three times before, but I never mentioned them because every single time I tried it, it just resulted in failure. So I kind of gave up after a while and I'm just like, you know, I'm just going to use cameras because, you know, what? it's not so bad. So let me just talk really quickly about camera let's plays because they're not as bad as a lot of people think they are. And I kind of want to just kind of talk, you know, about the fact that they're not as bad as they are. I've actually watched some people who uh, did uh, camera let's plays for a while, although I haven't watched them in a while mainly because those channels are gone but it was more for their commentary and let's for their fact of the fact that they um uh it was their quality i know quality is a big thing but i mean here's the thing if we're gonna judge everything by quality then that's i don't know i feel like it's stupid it's kind of like the fact that the whole um the the whole gaming war thing about the fact of that a lot of it's just about graphics and i really to be honest i mean graphics are important I think it depends on the game, really. But for the most part, I don't think they're as important, really, as... Oh, I don't know. Being able to play the game and the story. Uh, but then again, I don't really play, you know, games such as, you know, Modern Warfare 3 or anything like that. I'm, I'm not a big fan of those games. Uh, half for the reason that I just never really got into those games, and the other half of the reason is just, oh my god, the fan base. The fan base sometimes. But anywho, you saw me. Oh god, he saw me. He's, he sees me, Nate Terry. So anyways, uh, the thing is, is that, here's the thing. If you're going to do a, be it, if you want to use a camera, all I, let me just explain this really quickly. If you want to use a camera, I don't think that's bad, but let me just say this right now. You're going to want a very good camera, first off. Um, make sure that it, pro you probably want an HD camera, I would say. Second of all, you want an, um, you want a program such as Final Cut Pro or anything like that. 
that would let you upload into a high quality and, as, and also probably crop it and rotate it so that way it's actually balanced like the way I usually do it. Although that, that way is not entirely perfect, I still try. Oh my god, do I try. But anyways, I'm really sorry that I went through four years without it, but for those who have stuck with me for those four years, I really thank you guys. You stuck with me through the bad years. Well, not the bad years. To be honest, I really didn't mind the camera let's playing, and I've gone back to even just the early days of doing it, like my tie and my Paper Mario let's play. And to be honest, I really don't find those games to be that bad just because of the quality. In fact, I'd say that some of my older ones are some of my best ones. In fact, I find my Paper Mario Let's Play, they'll probably be one of my more be better Let's Plays. Sly 2 would have been one of my really good Let's Plays if it wasn't for my co op -er ditching out on me in the middle of it. <coughs> Sorry about that. I also find my Sly 3 Let's Play to be very, very entertaining. Don't go this way. What are you doing? That's where the train's coming. Um, so, I really don't find the fact that, you know, quality is like the huge thing of, of, of let's playing and I think if you're gonna base it solely on that I mean I don't know I, I just feel like it's it's kind of you're missing out on a lot of good let's players in fact I know oh, oh you shit you little yeah let's get out of here life oh shit 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 why can you aim so well this is crap run Tennessee kid you don't want another bullet hole in your ear how did he get that? Well, I know there's a lot of theories on that, but oh, oh fuck. Shh. Life. Let's play curse. Let's play curse. This isn't even a let's play. This isn't even a let's play. What the fuck? But anywho. So yeah, that's kind of this the whole thing of let's play of let's playing with cameras. I don't think it's bad, and I don't regret ever doing it. And in, in fact, if someone gave me the opportunity to like, start let's playing all over again and they said you could start with a capture device. I probably would but I mean like if I I mean the thing of it is is that like if someone ever asked me it's like do you do you think that do you wish that you could redo a bunch of your old let's plays with your capture device honestly I would say no I think the way that I did it I liked it and I there was a lot of funny moments in them and I don't really regret it although somehow if this channel like neon fox and color goes under and this channel is completely bye bye do not worry, I will continue to make Let's Plays and I will probably redo a bunch of the old games, but I mean like I'm not gonna only like spend the first four years redoing a bunch of old Let's Plays. Oh no, 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 no. That's 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 too much for, to ask of you guys. Anyways, I want to make this video short because I just want to explain stuff. So anyways, what my setup right now is I have a DVC uh, Dazzle right now recording this plugged in through my PS3 and essentially what's using to capture it is I'm using, I'm kind of doing a really dumb way of doing this. Right now, I have um, Video Glide capturing it, and God fucking damn it, guys! Video Glide is such a bitch to deal with. Let me uh, let me just explain something. If you guys are using Dazzle and you're gonna use Video Glide, if you have and you're using a Mac, if you have anything higher than 10.7, I believe it is, or 10.8, it's not gonna work for you. I'm actually having to record this off of my laptop and not my main computer because. Oh my god, I never update my laptop, and my laptop is, o is only at uh, 10.6, so I'm just never going to update my laptop ever. Uh, unless I come up with something better, but this works for me now. Woo! Silver belt buckle. That was really loud, sorry. Anywho, um, and so I'm using Video Glide to capture this, and god is it a bitch. Um, and so to record the game audio right now, I actually have QuickTime running, and it's capturing the audio uh, while recording off my screen. And then I have Audacity recording my voice. It's not the most perfect setup, but uh, it's gonna do for now. I don't think it's that bad. I just have no time. The only problem is I have no like semblance of how long this is. So hopefully this isn't gonna be like a 21 minute video. So anyways, I just wanna thank you guys for staying with me through my camera let's playing years. I think those games were good. I really wish I could have done Sly 4 in it though. I think maybe that's my only regret, but whatever i enjoyed it i think it was good um for those doing my camera let's plays though let me just say this on how to make the footage better look at it in 720p okay because i got a lot of complaints of people saying it was really shoddy work i'm like is it in 720p and they're like no i'm like then look at it at 720p it looks a lot better they're like well i can only look at it in 360p everything looks shitty in 360p of course 
Have you ever watched some of Chugga Conrad's Let's Play in 360p? They look horrible. Everything looks horrible in 360p. It's not high def. I make my videos so that they are in high def, at least starting after um, Sonic Colors. But anyways, uh, that's a lot about that. You've just been seeing me playing around as Tennessee K. Cooper. I haven't really been doing much. I'm, I just kind of want to see if this works. Anywho, what I think this really should be up for, blah shit, is let's play number 21. What am I going to do for that? Because I actually have a game in mind. And I think I'm going to give you guys some clues. Because the thing is, I'm actually not going to start this game for a while. Because I want to get a bunch of the files done with. And so that way, I'm not doing this whole thing of where I absolutely have no files to upload. Because I've been do I did that a lot. And God, that just... That was a bad idea. So anywho, what I'm doing... What I'm... Uh, let me... Uh, God, dude, just say things while pickpocketing. This isn't hard. You're the kid. Um... Oh god, okay, let's just get to the clues for the next Let's Play. One of them is, in fact, the release date. So, here are the three clues. <coughs> Sorry. Clue number one is the word for an unspecified large number. So, this is, it's a term for a very large number. But it's not a specific number. So, like, a million, a billion, a quadrillion, no, 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 no. No, it's not a specific number. This is, like, it's a general term for a very, very large number. But it's not a specific one. It doesn't actually have a numeric value. So that's your first clue. Your second clue is the Roman numeral for the number 13. Very simple, all right? And your third clue is the release date. Well, kinda-ish. The third clue is February 25th, 2014. There is a game that's gonna be released and it's somewhat related to this game but somewhat not and if you know what game it is and if you're familiar with the series then you'll understand exactly what i mean so here is to a happy four years of let's playing on this channel and here's to many many more as you can see i'm nowhere near done quitting and there is only going to be more for me you guys are not going to shake me that easy one last thing though, um, I've been wanting to kind of go about this of my nickname on this channel. I used to go by Skulk for a very long time. Let me just really quickly explain this. Um, uh, this is something I'm not proud of. For a while I used to be a furry, um, but I left that community because to be honest, I hated it and I no longer want to associate with that. I'm going to be honest, yes I will used to be a part of it, but the thing is, is that I was kind of young. I I really didn't know what I was getting into. I'm older, and I know better, and to be honest, uh, if you are one, great. I don't really care, but to be honest, I, I'm not a furry anymore. I had a very bad experience with the community. Some friends that I thought were friends turned out to not be friends. They just really didn't care about me um, because of certain opinions that I had. Very, like, literally, I got a lot of hate for very stupid things. At the time, I was Christian. Um, and I got a lot of hate for that, and I think that's really stupid. I'm not Christian anymore, I'm agnostic, but I really think it's stupid to hate on people just based on their religion. Uh, but yeah, I left it for a very long time, so Skulk was my nickname, but it's not anymore. Um, my real name is Blake. If you want to go from by that, then that's fine. But I've been lately going by a different nickname, and it's because of my family. And funny enough, it's related to this game. It's Mapache. I have a very Spanish family, and, um, I have an aunt's name, um... Auntie Mia, and essentially, oh god, there are guards around here, I better move, move my ass, move my ass, move my ass, this is, guy is going the other way, dude, um, and anyway, she likes to give, um, animal nicknames to everyone, and she not, she hasn't really met me since I was really little, so she never gave me one, and so she decided to give me the nickname Apache, uh, which is the Spanish word for raccoon, ha, oh god, he caught me, why did I do that, <laughs> was that really worth it, was that worth it, so worth it, <coughs> so anyways, my Spanish nickname so my Spanish nickname is Mapache, and lately my friends have been calling me that. So I might be going by that. Funny enough, uh I uh while I while we were given the option to change our channels, I don't know if I still can, but if I would have, I would have changed it to Mapache Studios, but I like Neon Fox Let's Plays. I've had it for four years. I've I've grown used to the name. I like it. I like it, turns out. <laughs> Cause it's related to kind of like Scandinavian-ish culture, and I like that, so I'm keeping it. So anyways, um, yeah, I think that's about it. So, 
I'm not gonna have another few. I'm not gonna have videos for a while. I don't know exactly if February 25th is gonna be the uh, release date for Let's Play Number 21, but keep posted. I will uh, update on if it will be. But still, number three is still a clue. February 25th, 2014. There will be a game release. Blah blah blah. You know, I just said it. So guys, on that note, I think I'm gonna end off here because I'm pretty sure this video has probably gone on for like 20 minutes. So. I will see you guys all when I start Let's Play 21, and thank god I finally got a capture device. I will see you guys all next time. Woo!